Chuck Lynch is the longtime innovative teaching pro at White Pines Golf Club in Bensonville. That 36-hole playground has improved its course conditioning and features a new banquet facility that can serve up to 350 people. It's always a great place to play. Only a half hour from downtown Chicago and right around the corner from O'Hare Airport lies two championship courses at White Pines. The West Course stretches out to over 6,600 yards from the back tees and presents a number of fair and fun challenges, including a monster par five on the back nine. 11 West is a great hole, over 600 yards from the back tees. Uh, it's a nice hole that bends down through some trees and plays a little downhill. You have to cross a creek to get to the green. Uh, some really mature old uh, trees up around the green, which really makes it a beautiful scene. On the East Course, we have a few really pretty holes. We've got some holes that are kind of tight when you get back into 14 and 15, very tree-lined and scenic. But for me, probably our 11th hole kind of stands out. It's a par three that plays over water with some native plantings on the uh, banks of the water, and just really a beautiful hole. White Pines sits on an unspoiled 240 acres of land, and there are many, many trees out here. But over the course of the last year, some 550 trees have been removed due to a pesky beetle known as the emerald ash borer. It's been a blessing in disguise though, as it has opened up some corridors on the courses and sped up play. It's definitely a necessity to help the course be you know, healthy and let the underlying areas uh, grow and take out safety concerns. Also from those trees that were taken down, new tea signs are being created. That's pretty good use of recycling. The instructional teaching options at White Pines are pretty impressive as well. We've also partnered with the First Tee of Greater Chicago to open up a new area uh, for them and for us. Uh, they're serving those children ages 7 to 17 and they're really building some great life skills and introducing them to golf. And then we have our professional staff here, Chuck Lynch and Marty Joyce, who the juniors are able to continue on with if they're interested in golf and want to, you know, take more private lessons. Um, they're able to do that and Chuck and Marty have done a great job here for years. The grounds crew led by Superintendent Aaron Hill have made the course more pristine than ever in spite of the hot humid summer we've been experiencing. The greens are rolling smooth and true, better than they have in years. I believe the conditioning is a lot better. Uh, my assistant prior to me coming here had already lowered the heights of cuts from the previous superintendent. So that got everything going from the get go. And then working with him, we've been really trying to concentrate on the soils and getting everything healthy from the ground up opposed to uh, putting band-aids on the turf. And that way we'll just get a much better product out of it and be more environmentally safe. When you have 36 holes, the logical name for the 19th hole is what else? 37 Bar and Grill. The fully renovated restaurant always has a number of fun activities and specials going on. From two championship courses, a brand new huge tented pavilion and the upstairs banquet room, nearly any size outing can be accommodated. We uh, were very fortunate with board support this year to be able to build out a 6,000 square foot pavilion tent that we can host any kind of banquet, any kind of golf outing in. Uh, the tent itself seats around 350, it can be a little more or a little less just depending on the setup, but uh, it's really been a nice addition for us. White Pines looks outstanding and is one of the better bargains in Chicagoland as well.